We got the latest gameplay for Dragon Ball Sparking Zero back on March 20th. During the showcase which unveiled the new Sparking Zero gameplay, we saw Goku and Vegeta turn Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan. What is weird about the transformations is that Goku and Vegeta skip their transformations and go straight to Super Saiyan Blue. Now normally no one would think this is weird, but hear me out. Something weird is happening with transformations in Sparking Zero because if we look closely, such as BT3, if you skip a transformation, it actually costs more stock the higher the transformation is. So for example, if Goku was to try to go from base to Super Saiyan 3, it costs 3 stock. However, Goku and Vegeta are only using 2 stock to go from their base to Super Saiyan Blue. Now, assuming Goku and Vegeta do in fact have access to Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan God, and Super Saiyan Blue, as the Rivals trailer kind of alludes to, it should take 3 skill count to transform from base to Super Saiyan Blue. What could be going on here is one of two possible things. The first thing that could be happening here is, is that we're actually getting some form of customization which allows us to pick our transformations prior to battle. This would mean that perhaps there's maybe one or two transformations allowed so it doesn't become a transformation fest. If that's the case, then it does beg the question that is there truly a limit? And then the second likelihood that this could be going on is that this is in fact an earlier build and being an earlier build they didn't have everything quite figured out just yet and that's why it only takes two while in the final build of the game it will take three stock to go from base to super sam blue fact of the matter is is that since this is a build they showed off and skill count is going to be an important mechanic of the game, something tells me that they didn't quite mess that up, and something in fact is going on weird with transformations in regards to Dragon Ball Sparking Zero, because then we also have to consider the fusions and other special transformations that could be implemented in this game. How are those gonna ultimately work in this game? Will they be balanced or will you be able to whip those out very fast? Only time will tell, but I wanted to bring this to you guys' attention because I thought it was actually interesting. I watched the gameplay trailer several times and I thought I was losing it, but I noticed we're losing two stock only when going from regular to Super Saiyan Blue. If anybody has an idea what's going on here, let me know in the comment section. If you guys haven't already, join the Discord. If you want to be first on any news or things happening in the community, make sure you join the Discord. I'm usually in there. I'm chatting with the guys, and they're always posting news and updates, so don't miss out. Join Discord. It's in the description. But with that said, I am Makai Sand. Please hit the subscribe button. I'll catch you guys later.